Hello friends, today we are going to learn how to program STM32 Nucleo board using HAL library with STM32 Cube MX and STM32 Cube IDE. So let us get started step by step. So now I will open STM32 Cube MX. STM32, this is Cube MX. Click over here. Okay. So uh, I am using here STM32 F411RE controller. Uh, it is Nucleo board. So I will select here Nucleo board. So click on access to board selector. Okay. So this is board selector here. I will search Nucleo F411RE okay so you can see here this is board click over here and this is board detail so i am not going to board detail just click on start project yes okay so this is controller Okay, you can see uh, by default there is user pin TXRX and this is uh, programmer pin and this is internal LED pin and this is uh, button pin. Okay, so I will reset it. I will remove, click on pin out and clear pin out. Okay, yes. Now I have connected one LED on PB1 pin. So just I will make program to blink the LED with 100 millisecond. Okay. So now go to system core here. First click on system and we will select here and click over here. Go to serial wire uh, because of uh, debugger is connected on this port. Okay. So you can see here PA14 and PA13. This is SWDIO pin and SWCLK pin. Okay. And another thing I will go to RCC here select clock pin. So this is HSC high speed clock. Just select bypass clock source because of uh, in our board there is no external clock. So uh, we are going to use internal uh, clock and another low speed clock this is used for RTC so we can select this okay and another thing we are we will go to GPIO okay we are going to just toggle this pin uh, PB1 pin so just click over here PB1 and uh, here select GPIO output okay so this pin is selected as a gpio output if you want to think something you can change over here uh, gpio level uh, output level low and um, gpio mode post pull you can select here but i will select default setting i will not change anything if you want to change you can change output is low and high so i will select here uh, output level high now this pin is selected as a output so this is completed now go to generate code click over here this project cannot name be empty okay we will type here name stm32 gpio output okay uh, just select the directory where we want to save okay and here 
I am using here STM Cube IDE. So I will select STM32 Cube IDE. Okay. And here linker setting is there. You can change if required, but I don't change anything. Okay. Just click on generate code. So here code is generated. Now I will open this folder. Okay. And I will open this project. Okay, HTM32 cube ID is opening. Okay, launch. Okay, successfully imported this project. Okay. Now uh, this is project. You can see here code. Okay, go to core and source. There is main.c file. Okay, so uh, you can see there is system clock configuration function. So system clock is configured here, and another function is GPIO init. So there is a GPIO initialization function. Okay, so here this is uh, initialization. It is initialized for PB1 B port and PB1 uh, pin. First pin you can see here GPIO pin 1. Okay, this is no, there is no pull up and GPIO speed frequency is low. Okay, so you can see there is while loop here i will type the code for led low and high so there is hal gpio right pin okay i will copy and paste here okay so it is set PB1 pin is high. Okay. So there is port B and pin number 1. It is set. Function name is HAL GPIO write pin. Okay. I will use here delay. This is HAL underscore delay with 100 millisecond. Okay, again I will copy this function and paste here. Okay, now copy this delay function and paste here. Okay, and now code is ready. So just I will build the code. Uh, click on build ok now click on run uh, go to debugger setting here uh, this is ok and click on ST link and click on scan ok debugger is detected now apply and ok so ok debugger is connected and code download verified successfully wow you can see LED is blinking with 100 millisecond okay so friends i hope you enjoyed this video if you really like this video you can do like subscribe and share thanks for watching